Hi friends and welcome back to Irrational Gamer YouTube channel. Today I will tell you how you can find any game's save location in no time. So first thing you will need is this program designed for Windows. The name of the program is Process Monitor. It is a free program and if you Google you can easily find it and download it for your computer. After you have downloaded it just run the exe file i am on windows 10 64 bit so i will choose the process monitor 64.exe file double click it and it will start monitoring all the keys which are currently windows is reading or writing into the registry and even all the files which are currently being accessed uh, being written or which are windows currently reading so you can scroll all the way down and you can see it is constantly working and displaying you everything that is currently going on with your pc if you want you can click this filter and choose a specific pr process add it here but I will show you how to check using this program where are your save games for any game you select. So for this demo I will run the Splinter Cell Blacklist game. I am really not sure where are the save files for this game. So after you run a game just load a game and after that just quit the game and you can find all the information about that game in that program process monitor as you can see i have just launched splinter cell blacklist and i will click resume at checkpoint because this game is already saved and now it will load the game from a location within your hard disk and the game is loaded that's it you can now quit the game by pressing the escape key quit to desktop continue that's it now you need this program to stop capturing all the events because you have done what you wanted so i will click here capture the shortcut key is control e and it is no longer capturing anything furthermore you can also disable the auto scroll feature or enable it by going to the options of this program but right now let me just show you what actually happened with the splinter cell blacklist and where are the save files for splinter cell blacklist we need to find the process here here it is blacklist direct x11 underscore game dot xe and as you can see this game has read and written so many keys into the registry itself but we want to file we want to find what files it tried to access so as you can see here blacklist directx game.exe created file in this folder and etc etc so if you want you can right click the game process and click include blacklist underscore dx11 dot and uh, game.exe so whatever game you are running just right click on its .exe file process and then choose include the game name .exe and what that would do is it will filter out all the other processes you can see all the way around here so you don't have to go all the way and find one by one so it will take some time and 
after it is done i will show you the processes blacklist game used and whatever files it tried to access and whatever files it tried to write okay so the filter process is done so we have only the game processes and file monitoring list here i want to look for the c drive and that's where my windows is installed and we all know that modern games always save their save file into the uh, c drive somewhere in the c drive as you can see here the game goes to c users my username documents folder ubi soft blacklist folder so i will right click any of these and click jump to and that will open that folder so here's the path for this game's save file this is your save file so i hope you liked today's video if you did make sure you subscribe to irrational gamer goodbye